Periodontal disease is an infection of the teeth, gums, and the bone that surrounds the teeth. And it's the leading cause of adult tooth loss. Stopping this condition begins with a thorough diagnosis. The main cause of periodontal disease is the accumulation of plaque, the sticky film of food and bacteria that forms constantly on your teeth. It's hard to see plaque, but look at how it shows up after we've stained it with red dye. The bacteria and plaque invade the spaces between the teeth and gums and begin producing toxins. These toxins, combined with your body's reaction to them, destroys the bone around your teeth. Once bone has been lost, it never grows back on its own. When too much bone is lost, there is so little support for the teeth, they get loose and have to be removed. If you have periodontal disease, you may have some of these symptoms. Persistent bad breath, bleeding of the gums when brushing or flossing, soft, swollen or tender gums, gums pulling away from the teeth, and loose teeth. These are healthy gums. They're tight against the teeth, there aren't any pockets, and they don't bleed. Now notice the difference with early periodontal disease and moderate periodontal disease. You can see the red and swollen infection of the gums. Look especially close at the inflammation of the gums between the teeth. This is where periodontal disease usually starts. It is also possible to have no noticeable symptoms. In fact, most people who have periodontal disease aren't even aware of it. Because of this, we perform a thorough examination with a periodontal probe and x-rays. Periodontal probing measures the depth of the pockets in your gums. We measure the pocket from the bottom of the pocket, where it's attached to the tooth, to the top of the gums. A probe reading of more than 3 millimeters is a sign of periodontal disease. In general, the deeper the pockets, the greater the spread of periodontal disease. Gums sometimes bleed during probing. This is also a sign of infection. X-rays tell us a lot about periodontal disease. This is a healthy mouth. The bone comes up high around the necks of the teeth, and it's even throughout the mouth. This is advanced periodontal disease. The bone level is much lower. Notice how uneven the bone levels are, compared with the healthy mouth, and notice the tartar on the teeth. Tartar shows up on this x-ray as small white lumps on the sides of the teeth. Once we've found periodontal disease, we'll talk with you about treatment options and proper home care to minimize bone loss and restore the health of your gums.